Hi, this is Halal. In this video on Mathematical Economic Series, we will solve a numerical that was asked uh, in an examination uh, recently. The question is, uh, suppose the consumption function is given as that is C is equal to 100 plus 0.8 Y subscript D, where C is the consumption and Y subscript D denotes the disposable income. Uh, investment is given as 50, that is the autonomous uh, investment obviously here. And government expenditure is given as 200 and uh, tax rate is given as T is equal to um, 0.1 times Y. Okay. Uh, the question tells us calculate budget deficit or surplus. The options are given as uh, deb uh, the correct option, uh, rather the multiple options are given as and one among them is the correct option. The first option is deficit of 75, uh, second is surplus of 75, third is uh, deficit of 125, and last one is surplus of 125 million or whatever you call it. Okay, so first of all, we have to see what is the budget surplus or budget deficit. It is very simple budget deficit, budget deficit is simply when uh, the government expenditure exceeds the tax revenue that is uh, when government expenditure is greater than the taxes okay similarly we have a situation of budget surplus okay when the government expenditure government expenditure is less than the tax revenue that is government expenditure is less than the tax revenue okay that means uh, to get uh, the budget deficit and the magnitude of the budget deficit, uh, we should have G minus T. Similarly, to get the budget surplus, uh, we have to subtract these two terms. And to get the numerical value or the magnitude, we just subtract these two terms. Okay. The, uh, sorry, here it is T minus G would be the case. T minus G. Okay. Now, what we have to uh, calculate here, we have to find this T government expenditure is given as, okay, so we have to find this very T. Since T is a function of income, that means we have to find uh, the income also to get uh, the value of tax. That means, first we will write our formula that is Y is equal to C plus I plus G. This is our uh, GDP formula, okay? That is income is equal to consumption expenditure plus investment expenditure uh, plus government expenditure, okay? So our C is given as our consumption function is this uh, 100, 100 uh, plus 0 0.8 times Y subscript D, that is the disposable income. Uh, Plus the investment is given as 50, so I will write 50. Uh, plus uh, the government expenditure is given as 200, so I will write here 200. Okay, this is our formula. Now this will come out to be 100 plus 0 0.8, and here we can see this uh, disposable uh, uh, D, uh, rather this Y, disposable income is uh, actually equal to y minus t that is when we uh, deduct uh, the tax from our income we get the disposable income okay so y minus t gives us the disposable income plus 50 plus 200 okay now we have here 100 plus 0 0.8 times y minus the tax is given as that is t is equal to 0.1y. So in place of t, I will I can write 0.1y plus now 200 uh, plus 50 is equal to 250. So I will write here 250 and this comes out to be 250 plus 100 is equal to 350 plus uh, 0 0.8. Now y minus 0.1y is equal to uh, so I will write here this is equal to 0 0.9 y okay that means our income that is this is the relation y is equal to 350 plus 0 0.8 times 0 0.91 we can 
further solve this 350 plus 0.8 uh, into 0.9 is equal to 0.72 y okay now what will we do we just uh, uh, transpose this term on LHS so this will get subtracted that is y minus 0.72 y is equal to 350 okay now y minus 0.72 uh, y is equal to that is equal to now y, y minus 0 uh, 1 minus 0 0.72 is equal to 0 0.28 y should be equal to 350 or in place of 28 i can write 0.28 i can write like this is equal to 350 i just uh, converted this decimal expansion into the fraction okay or i can write y is equal to 350 times when transposing this will get reciprocated so this will become 100 100 divided by 20 okay now solving this this is 7 4 the 28 7 5 the 35 so this is 50 into 100 that is equal to 500 or we can write it 4 ones are 4 25 is are so we will get 50 into 25 okay or solving this will give us we have 5 5 is are 25 5 2 is are 10 11 12 so we get 1250 is the income level okay now so we are done uh, with this y now we can actually calculate our g is given as g is given as 200 now this tax is given as t is equal to 0.1 times the value of y which we got here which is equal to uh, 1250 and i can write it like this 1 divided by 10 times 1250 this 0 and 0 will get cancelled we get 125 okay this is our tax this is our government expansion okay now here we can uh, clearly see that government uh, expenditure is greater than tax revenue that is government expenditure is greater than tax revenue so in this case we would have um, the budget deficit okay since uh, the tax uh, revenue is less than the government expenditure we would have the uh, deficit situation so obviously either this option would be correct or this value option would be correct now to calculate the magnitude of the uh, budget deficit we just uh, subtract g minus t will give us the budget deficit budget deficit so our government expenditure is 200 200 minus the tax revenue is 125 and here we can see it is 75 so the correct option in this case would be uh, 75 the deficit of uh, the deficit of 75 that is the correct option would be the first option that is a option i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you if you like this video please subscribe and share so that i get inspired to make more videos on the mathematical economics i am